saying that I don't understand, that this man is telling the truth, that everyone is attacking him and he's a victim. <laughs> This dude is, he's, he's okay. Listen, <laughs> this is almost similar to when, you know, when, um, when, when somebody get locked up for shooting somebody, somebody get locked up for murder or somebody get locked up for something. They committed the crime. They clearly committed, committed the crime, but their friends and their family be like, man, free my, free my man, such and such. <laughs> They can't, they always trying to hold a good man down. <laughs> Your boy just shot somebody and you want him freed? What? Your boy just now got caught selling drugs all, all, all over his community and you want him to be free? Free my N word, Mike Mike. <laughs> free my man, Black. Free my man, Killer, Killer Mike. <laughs> They always trying to hold a good man down. He only locked up because they put drugs in our community. I get it, man. Listen, Killer Mike has shown, he was showing love to somebody. I'm sure he showed love to his mother. He probably showed love to his father. He probably showed love to his baby mother and even his kids. He showed love to his homies. He showed love to his friends, his, probably his teachers, his pastor. He probably showed love to his, his pastor. But Killer Mike killed somebody and got arrested. Now everybody talking about, but he a good dude. He only liked that because they put drugs in our in our community. <laughs> free pedo, free pedo, um, pedo Peter. <laughs> so right here, Kanye is trying to drive home the point that. You know how when uh, when they tried to they try to get um, they try to get Trump on um, him saying there's good people on both on both sides. <laughs> this is not the same. This is Kanye losing his ever loving mind, man. Listen, man, what's up, Brent? Listen, man. Kanye is K Kanye is he's he's different. He's different. So in this in this right here, he says I like. We got to stop dissing Nazis all the time. When I very first saw this, I was like, nah, he didn't say that. I mean, although it's in quotations, he didn't really say that. Shout out to Real Daria Valley. Thank you so much for this one right here. So hold on, hold on. I want to, he's just going through a manic phase again. Listen, he's going through whatever he's going through and I'm not attacking him. I'm not, <laughs> I'm not. The brother just needs to take his meds, man. Sometimes the doctors know what they're doing. Take your meds. <laughs> listen to this right here. Hold on. Uh, listen to this. Hold up. Alex Jones. Watch how uncomfortable he make Alex Jones. You cannot make Alex Jones uncomfortable. But he, Kanye is about to make Alex Jones uncomfortable. <laughs> Watch this. I've said it the most like activities I've seen. Um, and, and these, in my view, were thugs that shook people down to a lot of really bad things. But they did good things, too. We're going to stop dissing all the time. Okay. We're, we're going to get to that. <laughs> you get, I don't... <laughs> they did some good things, too. We got to stop dissing all the time. <laughs> And what the hell does he have on, man? Old wrestling mask he got on. Come on, man. Hold on, just so y'all have more context. Let me go to Twitter right now. Let me go to Twitter. Because y'all got to see this right now. Somebody tagged me in this earlier today. I don't even know why people follow me on Twitter. But check this out right here. So he's on. <laughs> Kanye. Somebody please tell Kanye. If you're going to run for president. Take your meds, please. If you're going to run for president, just consider taking your meds, okay? Because now you're showing up to people's dad going uh, uh, podcast with, with wrestling masks on 
and and they don't know what the hell you're talking about, bro. They trying to figure out what in the world is going on with you, man. They really want to know. So listen to this right here. He's on he's on Alex Jones show, Infowars, and this is what he says, bro. This is what he says. First of all, this is this is what he said first. I've said it the most like activities I've seen, um, and, and the in my view were thugs that shook people down to a lot of really bad things. But they did good things too. We're gonna stop dissing these all the time. Okay, we're we're gonna get to that. <laughs> Alex Jones said, "Okay, okay, okay, we're gonna get to that." <laughs> Okay, we're going to get to that. <laughs> he said, okay, we're going to get to that. He made Alex Jones feel uncomfortable, man. But watch this tweet. Watch this Twitter right here. He says more on this right here. I need y'all to see this, man. This is important. This is important. This is the news. This is our future president of 2024. We got to cover this. Of it. And now people are like, wait a second. The, the so-called crime doesn't deserve the punishment. What did I, I thought? That's right. You're not here. You're not you don't deserve to be called that and demonized. Well, I I see I I see good things about him also. The Jew I love everyone, and Jewish people are not going to tell me you can love, um, you know, us, and you can love what we're doing to you with the contracts, and you can love what we're you know what we're pushing with the pornography. But this guy that invented highways, invented the very microphone that I use as a musician. You can't say out loud that this person ever did anything good, and I'm done with that. I'm done with the classifications. Every human being has something of value that they brought to the table. Every human being does have something of value, bro, but you cannot speak kindly about a person that decided to destroy an entire nation of people like they just they literally decided to they wanted to wash at a complete group of people off plant off the planet bro and you say whoa whoa what i know this there's, there's some good and are you his therapist bro here's the thing man and a lot of y'all need to understand Kanye is pissed off that they they took his money from him and that they attacked him. So he is he don't give a damn about anything else but get back. Vengeance. Vengeance, vengeance, vengeance. Okay? Now, if you are godly, then you know that vengeance is mine, said the Lord. Vengeance will be squared away. People who have done you wrong, they will they will get theirs. God will judge them. But when you put yourself in a position to try to destroy a people and get on the side of their, you want to just, you want to take up arms with their enemy now. Like we want to love on and, and, and kiss on and, and hold the people who done them wrong. Dude, your group is in that. But you're saying, whoa, 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 whoa. Stop talking about they did some great things too. Huh? They did some amazing. What? Come on. This is y'all president. This is y'all president of 2024. The one that y'all keep on fussing at me about in the comment section because I go too hard on him. Because I'm not one of those people that's attached to his glutes trying to trying to say, but Ye is 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 telling the truth and they did him wrong. And you need to know the whole truth and, no, and nothing but the truth. Bro, this dude has a personal agenda to attack Jewish community. That's it. And he's gonna do it by any means necessary. And they have shown that, whoa, okay, you want to attack us? We're going to attack you. Huh? You from gangster rap. You know how it go. You hit me, we hit you back. So now he trying to hit back by becoming friends with their enemies. What? Didn't God say, I will prepare a table for you in the presence of your enemies? God would do all of that. If you're really allowing God to do it, God didn't tell you to put that mask on your face and go on to Alex Jones' show and say what you're saying. God didn't tell you to do that, brother. I want him to be okay. But he needs to take his meds, man. This is crazy. Especially, how about that one? Ari Emanuel, how you like that one? Hey, Ron, you got done with the classifications. Every human being has something of value that they brought to the table. 
especially every human being has something of value that they brought to the table, especially. This is the guy right here that y'all, y'all keep on saying, listen, y'all keep on saying that he's the victim here. He's the one, listen, they, I'm getting, I'm getting emails. <laughs> I'm getting emails from people saying, Van, you don't know the whole truth. You're not listening to the whole story. Tim Pool told him that he would allow him to say whatever he wanted to say on his show, which Tim Pool did allow him to say whatever he wanted him to say. But Tim Pool wouldn't allow Kanye to turn him into a puppet and get on the same bandwagon. Look, yay, you came into my studio with Nick and with Milo. And y'all are going to say whatever y'all want to say. Listen, I'm giving you a platform. Say what you want to say. Go for it. But you can't force me to say it. And now this is what he's saying. I like it. We got to stop dissing the Nazis all the time. Are you kidding me, man? <laughs> this is y'all guy, though. Hey, yay 2024. <laughs> Y'all out your daggone mind, you're going to vote for Kanye for president. You out your, I don't think he's going to win. That's probably why I'm joking so much. I'm, I'm joking because I already know that nobody's going to take this seriously. And if they do, I really want to know what am I missing. Please school me in the comment section. Send me messages. Do whatever you want to do to make sure that I get the point. I want to understand why you're still holding on and supporting his stance. This is, this is nuts. It's nuts. It's no, it, what else is it? The only thing else it is, is trail mix, okay? Nuts is in there. I tell you that damn much.